Welcome to Electricity Frenzy. Have you ever wondered if you can use a 220 volts fan motor in the United States, where the standard voltage is 110 volts? In this video, we'll explore this question and reveal why the answer is no. If you're an electrical enthusiast, you might be curious about how a fan motor that's designed for a higher voltage can operate at a lower voltage. It seems like a simple question, but the answer is more complex than you might think. So, can a 220 volts fan motor run on 110 volts? The short answer is no, but let's dive deeper to understand why. Let's get started. Voltage is a fundamental concept in electricity that refers to the difference in electrical potential between two points in a circuit. It's typically measured in volts and is an indication of the amount of electrical energy available to power a device or appliance. In the United States, the standard voltage is 110 volts, while in many other countries, it's 220 volts or higher. Now, onto the question of whether a 220 volts fan motor can run on 110 volts. The answer is no, it cannot. The reason for this is that a 220 volts motor is designed to operate at a higher voltage than the standard 110 volts in the United States. When the 220 volts motor is connected to a 110 volts outlet, the voltage applied to the motor will be half of what it was designed to handle. This will cause the motor to draw more current than it was designed for, as the current is inversely proportional to the voltage. The increased current will cause the windings to overheat, which can lead to insulation breakdown, short circuits, and ultimately, motor failure. In general, a motor designed to run at a higher voltage will have more turns of thinner wire in its windings. While a motor designed to run at a lower voltage will have fewer turns of thicker wire. This is because the voltage and the wire thickness determine the resistance and impedance of the windings. A higher voltage motor needs more turns of thinner wire to achieve the required impedance, while a lower voltage motor needs fewer turns of thicker wire. When you connect a 220 volts motor to a 110 volts outlet, the motor will not operate correctly, and there is a high risk of damage to the motor. The motor is specifically designed to handle the voltage and current that it was built for, and any deviation from those specifications can cause damage to the motor. In addition to the risk of motor damage, connecting a 220 volts motor to a 110 volts outlet can also pose a safety hazard. The increased current draw can cause the wiring and electrical components to overheat and potentially start a fire. So, if you have a 220 volts fan motor and you want to use it in the United States, what can you do? One solution is to purchase a step-up transformer, which is a device that increases the voltage from 110 volts to 220 volts. This will allow the motor to operate safely and efficiently at the appropriate voltage. In summary, a 220 volts fan motor cannot run on 110 volts because it's designed to operate at a higher voltage. To use a 220 volts motor in the United States, you'll need to use a step-up transformer to increase the voltage to the appropriate level. We hope this explanation has helped answer your question, and if you have any more questions or suggestions for future videos, please let us know. It is crucial to always use the correct voltage and power supply for your motor to ensure safe and reliable operation. If you are unsure about the voltage and power requirements for your motor, consult the manufacturer's specifications or a qualified electrician to ensure safe and proper operation. Thank you for watching Electricity Frenzy. If you found this video informative and helpful, please consider liking this video and subscribing to our channel for more exciting content like this. By subscribing, you'll be the first to know when we upload new videos and provide you with even more useful information on electrical systems, motors, and everything in between. So hit that subscribe button and join our community of fellow electricity enthusiasts.